we saw, because we we have the proof of this with Gavin Williamson, how much this sort of stuff matters to some of these people. And I find it incomprehensible. But we saw from the text with the Queen's funeral how much these he baubles really PC. matter. Pretty exactly. P C K B E W T F. Like, you know, like <laughs> these things really matter to these people. I don't understand. Well, I, I find it very difficult to sort of get my head around it. But clearly, you know, if you're someone like Gavin Williamson, having those letters after your name or before your name confers a certain political status. And he must have thought that in order to fight so hard just to go to the Queen's funeral, a woman, we assume, he barely knew. That when we talk about abolishing the House of Lords, we didn't realise it would actually come from within <laughs> by Boris Johnson, who decided that chaos and anarchy were the best way of getting rid of an upper house that had never served him particularly well. We've got more non-elected members of our legislature than elected ones. That is by any stretch of the imagination, crazy. And they're unaccountable, unknowable. They get three over 300 quid a day every day they turn up. And you know, we just, we just treat it, prime ministers just treat it as part of the course. You know, this is just something we can give to our staff and to our allies. You know, honestly, it would make, it would make a shame a banana republic. I think it's more likely, instead of the CBE, OBE that I dream of. I'm going to get a WTF. <laughs> I think Lewis is going to be Lord Goodall by the time we're reconvening. Oh, come on, next Lady week. Mateless. <laughs> Lady Mateless. Lady Mateless. We were working out Lady what. Lady I... Mateless of News Agents HQ. <laughs> exactly. The News Agents. This is a Global Player original podcast.